Hello everyone, Zane here and welcome back to my channel. Hope you're having a great day so far. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to unlock the Ishgard Restoration. Now, with my feelings aside, I'm still going to show you guys how to unlock it. The Ishgard Restoration is nothing more than a power leveling tool for your crafters. Simply put. I'm going to be doing this separate from my Beginner's Guide to Crafting series. And I'm going to be doing this on my Culinarian. Alright, so this way I deal with the way I want to teach people how to craft and then also do the power leveling me method at the same time. So this way, both sides are happy. Alright, so thanks to a recording snafu, I've already unlocked the restoration. So what I'm going to do is walk you through the process. So the first thing you need to do is complete the 3.3 main story quest simply by killing my brood brother Nidhogg. After that, finish the main story quest Litany for Peace and then a flyer will appear on this wall right next to me. It's going to be across from the main aetherite. So you click on it and then you come over here to the gatekeeper which is going to be standing right here. All right, this is not the quest. This is going to be staying right here, the gatekeeper. Then, what you're going to do, after talking to him, go to the pillars, and right about here, you'll be clicking on a destination, which will be taken into a cutscene. You'll be talking to different NPCs. No matter what dialogue you pick, it will continue the story. After you got to that, you talk to Fran, the NPC that's staying right next to you, you will give a bottle of wine and then you need to come back to the gatekeeper which is again going to be right here and then he'll let you into the firmament so what we're going to do is access it through the aether right here once you have gone accustomed to the firmament it will be unlocked through the aether right all right so when we get into the firmament we will continue Alright guys, so here we are in the firmament. Now, as you can see on Gilgamesh here we have completed phase 2 of the restoration. The restoration is server wide not account wide so once the, the restoration is done no matter who you are it will be done as well for you. Alright, so the first thing you need to do is talk to Bert over here then you will come over here, talk to Potkin. This is where you'll be turning in your collectibles. Then talk to Lizbeth over here. She is the Koopa of Fortune NPC. Basically, it's kind of like a uh, scratch ticket. You have to pass in five recipes with the scratch ticket Moogle stamp icon next to it, based on what level you're at. You pass in five. To get one scratch ticket and you can only have up to 10 at one time after you talk to them you come over here to the script NPC this is where you'll be passing in your scripts which are going to be called sky builder scripts you get 10,000 cap then you will run over here this will lead you into the diadem these NPCs here so first you talk to the guy who will be approving your materials that you bring back from the diadem and this one will bring you into the diadem. After you're done talking to those guys, you come over here. This NPC will be dealing with your ranking when we get the restoration season 2, which is probably going to be in 5.3. Click on them again, you can see your score for each job. The rewards you get from the achievements and then this will explain what you need to know about. After that come back to Bert, talk to him again, then come back to Potkin and then she or he, I think it's a he, yeah, he will unlock your log for the restoration 
It's going to be under Ishgard Restoration, under Special. Just hit Triangle if you're on PS4. You want to go to number two. Everything in number one is obsolete. You cannot do those anymore. So you have level 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, and then Expert Recipes, which is the ones that I have done a video about these already. You have to be at least level 16 in order to get into the Diadem. Alright. So that basically is how you unlock the Ishgard Restoration. Alright guys, so like I said, I'm going to be doing how you do it if you're going to be doing the power leveling method. Of course, I will be doing that in a separate video. But I just want to show you guys how to unlock the firmament. Alright guys, so pretty much that is going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like if you found this useful. Any comments, questions, and or concerns, please leave in the comment section down below. I'd be more than happy to cause out with any questions you might have. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new for more Final Fantasy XIV content. And as a reminder, make sure you hit that notification bell next to my subscribe button. It's where you guys never miss an upload. And follow me on all my social media at Zane Lionheart on Twitter and Facebook. So until next time, may for walk in the glorious light of Lord Bahamut. Take care, guys.